guys. I'm gonna say it like after every song, probably. Thank you so much for coming. This is a, this is amazing. What a treat. What a blessing. Man, we firmly believe in the promise where it says where two or more are gathered, not in the name of Phil or not in the name of a beautiful old church, but when two or more are gathered in the name of Jesus, God says that he promises to be in the midst of those people. And I tell you, man, we've been, uh, like I said, four or five places already. They've been so different, like Tennessee, North Carolina, Ohio, Pennsylvania, all with their own feels and vibes and, and congregations. But just the same God there. Man, it's been amazing. And we're so expectant and excited about being with you guys. How about Micah Tyler today, huh? Man. Amazing voice, heart of gold. Um, and how about this band that's up here with me, huh? Yeah. Uh, everybody give it up for Josh here, my buddy Josh on the bass. All sneaky and playing beautiful keys is AJ. Say hi, AJ. This is Joel on the drums. What's up, Joel? This is Taylor. Say hi, Taylor. And we also got an amazing crew. Say good job, crew. Man, so we just want to move forward. Um, we've got kind of a set list, but it can change. It can move around. But we just want to be. We just want to hang out with you guys. I know it's kind of crazy. You guys have something fun to look at. The screen's pretty, and the lights are shining in your eyes, and it's loud, and we're on the stage, and you're not. But somehow, maybe those first four songs just to warm up. For somehow, all of us just getting on the same page and at the same level. Um, we we hope you are entertained and you get you got to laugh with Micah and you hear his beautiful voice and hear about this amazing organization called Compassion and. We hope you enjoy our music. If you're just here to listen, then we hope you enjoy it. Um, but for those of you who believe in this Jesus that we started already singing about tonight, this God that created the moon and the stars, and for those of you who are on the same page that, that you have recognized that you need so badly a Savior um, to rid you of your sin and to redeem your soul from death, because we on the stage and on this tour have recognized that, that on our own, um, we are sinners, and on our own, we haven't done much to deserve much. But in Jesus, we believe we've been set free and forgiven. And our past, the things that we regret we've ever done have been forgotten. And God just has a future and a hope for all who might call upon his name. That's who we believe. And we believe that, that these nights can be something so much more than a moment of entertainment. But they can be a moment where we together, the people of God, if you would classify yourself as a child of God tonight, that with us, that we, the children of God, would come together and remember who God is and then respond to Him. I mean, this is a God who can hold the whole universe in, in His hand. This is a God so powerful that He can speak and stars burst into light. This is a God so amazing that He tells mountains to rise and they rise and valleys to go low and they go low and rivers to flow and oceans to roar and clouds to thunder. This is a God so amazing in that He can do all that and He holds it all together and yet He loved you and He loved me so much that He came into what He was holding. He was holding it together and He decided, you know, I'm going to step into it all. I'm going to meet these people, these humans, my sons, these, these creations in mine. You, me, I'm going to meet them on their turf, face to face. I'm going to show them what it means to live and to love. I'm going to, you know what he did? He, he sat with the sinful ones that no one else thought were worthy of being sit, sat with. He reached out and touched the lepers that no one would even dare about touching. He, he, he talked with those who were forgotten. He healed those who were sick. He shook things completely upside down and showed the world what love really is and showed the world who God is. The God who stoops before his disciples and washes their feet. The God who carries the weight of every one of our sins upon his shoulders there to the cross and then hung there even though he could have called down a legion of angels to wipe out. He was able to do it, wipe out this whole army in front of him. He didn't. He bore your sins and he bore my sins. And he took that pain and he felt our shame. It says in the Bible, for the joy that was set before him. And that joy we see now is here in this room. It's his children being forgiven and set free. It's his bride coming together and saying thank you. 
It's us being able to be called the people of God without any shame or chains holding us back. He's done it all. And then we get to see him one day face to face. This is the God that we want to sing to tonight. Who believes that 